As a general rule of thumb with everything, I always think about um, one third should be preparation and two thirds should be execution. So I always, as a general rule, err on the side of execution. I think that, you know, you could, you know, without any planning whatsoever, if you're not prepared at all, then, you know, you're, you will not know what you're looking for when you actually do execute. And therefore, you won't be able to take corrective action. Like you won't know if you're actually doing a good job or not unless you've kind of figured out what a good job actually means from beforehand. But then at the same time, spending too much time trying to figure out what that really means and to plan and prepare also means that you're taking time away from being in the wild, being in the market and getting uh, what's the most important thing for success, customer feedback. And so, so if, uh, you know, if you, if you, if you're thinking that you're, that maybe you're, you got sort of analysis paralysis and you're overthinking your social media strategy, it probably means that you are. And a better way of doing it is to spend, you know, a third of your time uh, planning and preparing and defining what success is and then the balance of the time actually uh, executing. And just know that, you know, executing on your strategy and ultimately becoming successful is not going to happen in one cycle. So you'll do, let's say, a third preparation, two thirds ex execution, and then you're going to come back to the uh, you know to, to the whiteboard and you will have uh, some more in input you know as I said you know input came from several different sources at Involver and, and for companies that I am involved in and that customer feedback loop is one that you should continually come back to every cycle and and you know uh, kind of you know revisit your assumptions and then execute again and what you'll actually find out later is that that one third of preparation and two thirds execution gets, um, you know, distributed slightly differently. Where, you know, you're not spending as much time on preparation the more you go through the cycles because you're just getting smarter and smarter, and you're figuring out more and more of what uh, success means, and also you're achieving more success, and you're just going from trying to move the big pieces around to then fine tuning, and that's uh, ultimately where you want to be, and you'll probably be there for forever. Uh, uh, you know, especially in new markets.